All right, let's get back to one of our top stories now. The Eastern Cape has confirmed its first COVID-19 case. Earlier, we heard from Premier Oscar Mabuyana calling for calm and vigilance. And now we're joined by Eastern Cape Health MEC Cindy Swakomba. MEC, thanks very much for your time this afternoon. I want to start off very quickly. So obviously, tracer teams are hard at work following up on people who may have come into contact with this 28-year-old woman who had traveled to Germany. How many people are uh, suspected to have been exposed to her and how many tests have subsequently been done? We only heard yesterday, we heard about four people that were exposed to her. However, as they came back from Germany, there were two. So we were looking at not only her, but rather even the other partner as they came back from Germany. We have then gone around to test those and trace them and found that there's nothing with them. There's and no symptoms, there's nothing. And we're only waiting for results to be confirmed today as the patient had gone to a private service in Islamba. Can you see what is apologies, what is the capacity of tracing teams and testing teams in your province? Well, we do have testing teams. We do have if, for instance, we are in East London, as we are in East London, we have got listed and separated from the others, not necessarily testing things for the whole province, but testing things for the whole East London, Port Elizabeth, Mtata, Susile Makiwane. Then, if you're looking at those, then we extended them to district response teams, which actually are able to get to district hospitals. And we have got 20 district hospitals and eight regional hospitals in the Eastern Cape. Hmm. MEC, we've seen the implementation of some strict uh, prevention um, methods in uh, large parts of the country, closing of schools, uh, restriction to hours and sale of alcohol uh, to pubs and restaurants. Are those same implement, uh, measures being implemented in the Eastern Cape? Your land is a bit bad. Yes, I can repeat that. Have uh, the, the, the operating hours and the sale of alcohol been restricted to pubs and restaurants in the Eastern Cape as well? Are those measures being implemented as a prevention to the spread of coronavirus? When the announcement was made in terms of alcohol trading, immediately the public safety and the economic cluster did meet and amongst the issues that they actually took into their, I mean, their authority and post responsibility was to ensure that there will be patrols in ensuring that those are observed. So currently we're dealing with that. Thank you very much. We have been speaking to uh, Eastern Cape Health MEC Cindy Swagomba about the news that one confirmed case has been uh, reported in the Eastern Cape.